Thanks, y'all. Here's what's happening in the wild and oft times wacky world of sports. The Kings and Raptors battled down to a controversial end Sunday night. Let's take a look at some highlights. First, we'll start off with a Darren Collison steal, starting off the fast break, kicking it to Rudy Gay, who goes all the way up for the slam. And here's the controversial ending. The Raptors getting into Terrence Ross, launching it from 25. Hey, Scott! Or is it? The referees reviewed it. And if you look closely, DeMarcus, hands, cousin, DeMarcus Cousins' hands touches the ball. The clock should have started. Ross doesn't know this. He times it up with the clock he sees, and he shoots it off in time, but the refs have to wave it off. Kings sneak away with this one, 102-99. The NBA has released its last two minutes report, stating that no call was incorrect. University of Texas uh, Austin football coach Charlie Strong is likely out after a tough overtime loss to Kansas. When asked about what the loss means for his future, uh, Strong rather knowingly shook his head and said, no idea, I don't know. The program has been struggling under Strong's leadership, and while many anticipate a change, some people on Twitter jump to conclusions declaring Strong fired, according to sources, which of course forces a program that will almost assuredly part ways with the coach to come out and say that there are no talks because there's still games left to be played. But when the decision does come out, we'll all look worse for it, except for the ringer's Roger Sherman, who tweeted out, breaking news, I guess Charlie Strong will be fired in the next few days, so I'm tweeting he just got fired, so I look like I have sources. For updates, reread that tweet at home. LeBron James will be honoring the late great Muhammad Ali with a $2.5 million donation. The donation will go to the National Smithsonian Museum for African American History and Culture to support its exhibit named Muhammad Ali, A Force for Change. Speaking on his donation, uh, James said every professional athlete, regardless of race and gender, owes a huge debt of gratitude to Muhammad Ali. His legacy deserves to be studied and revered by every generation. Lani Ali, Muhammad's wife, tweeted how overwhelmed she was by James' donation. He responded, humbled, not a day goes by when I think about or try to honor your husband's legacy. A wonderful and generous act to preserve a legacy's necessary memory. Sunday night, Cam Newton reminded us why he's the greatest quarterback to ever wear cleats with foxtails. Let's take a look at a few highlights from the Panthers-Saints game Sunday night. We'll start it off with a blocked kick by the Saints, picked up by Luke Keekley. And he runs it in for an 80-yard touchdown. It's an exciting play. Luke Keekley is still under concussion protocol. It's a bit scary. Not on this play. He makes it all the way to the end zone very safely. And what a great touchdown. Oh, or is it? It was waved off again. And here's Cam Newton with an excellent 50-yard bomb for a touchdown. They'll also try to wave this one off, but it holds up in appeals court. And the Panthers win it 23-20. That's it for sports. Back to you all, Sean and Claire.